Hey, Marvin, your phone's ringing. I know, I can hear it. It's right next to me. Okay, fine. Hello? Uh, hello. This is Jackie Chu, Jeffy's teacher. I was calling to tell you that Jeffy's gonna be getting her report card today, just in case he doesn't show you. All right, thank you for warning me. Who was that, Marvin? It was Jeffy's teacher. Let me know he's getting his report card today. Ooh. Ah, Daddy, help me! I was playing on my shirt and it started eating me! It was not eating you, Jeffy. Ah! It was just stuck. All right, thanks, Danny, for saving me from the big bad shirt monster. Well, look, Jeffy, your teacher just called me and let me know you're getting your report card today. So don't try to throw it away or anything. You have to show me. Okay, Danny. Well, there's not going to be any bad grades on it because I'm the smartest boy ill. Well, look, if there's a single F on that report card, your life's over. You're grounded for a year. Okay, Danny, but there's not going to be any Fs on it. Well, look, get to school. Get your butt to school. Oh, just my butt? Art, right, can you help me take it off? Well, no, get your whole body. Just get, go to school. All right, Danny. All right, Crass, today, before we get started, I'm going to hand out your report cards. Here you go, Penelope. Here's your report card. All A's, yes! Junior, here's your report card. Only one F? That's a new record. And Joseph, here's your report card. Oh, dude, I finally did it! All F's. You know how hard it is to do that? Wow, Joseph, that's very impressive. <laughs> Thank you. And Cody, here's your report card. All A's. I knew it. You know, sometimes I get tired of being so smart. Maybe you should get all F's like me. <laughs> I'm good. All right, Bori, here's your report card. Eh, whatever. I'm just gonna be a trash man like my dad anyway. And Jeffy, here's your report card. Oh, oh no, all Fs. My daddy's gonna kill me. Oh, oh. Guys, guys, I got all Fs on my report card. High five. No, because my daddy told me he was gonna kill me if I got a single F. Well, I don't have parents, so. Well, Jeffy, why don't you just take Cody's report card home and say it's yours? But no, that's not gonna work because my report card has my name on it. And besides, I save all my report cards because I want to get into a good college someday. Oh, and my mom gives me Zerberts on my belly for every A I get. What's a Zerbert? It's where she blows on my tummy and I'm super ticklish. God, I hate you, Cody. But guys, for real, my daddy said he's gonna kill me if I get an F on my report card. That's it, Jeffy. Why don't we fake your death? Why don't we call your dad and say you died at school today and he'll never see you ever again? But no, Junior, that's a terrible idea. Doesn't that seem kind of extreme just to avoid getting punished? Well, my daddy said he's gonna kill me anyway, so we might as well do it. Okay, I'll grab my phone. All right, All right guys, it's ringing. Aren't they just gonna look at the caller ID and see who it is? I blocked my number, Cody. Shut up. <sighs> Baby, can you answer the phone? Sure, Marvin. Hello? Hey, I mean, hey, this is Officer Tells Bad News Johnson. I'm calling to inform you that your son Jeffy died today at school. What? I know, you seem very upset. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. What happened? Well, um, Jeffy and another student were playing tag during recess, and Jeffy fell into a pile of ants. And then a plane crashed, only killing your son. The ants are fine, though. They're fire ants. They were normal ants until the fire from the plane explosion turned them into fire ants. But, uh, he's dead. Oh my god! Is it gonna be on the news? Uh, no, it won't be on the news because the owner of the news, Sir Isaac Newsten, was the one flying the plane. And he didn't have his pilot's license, so he crashed his plane. And that will make the news have a bad name. So, we just don't want anyone to know about it. Oh my god! My poor Jimmy! Yeah, so, he's dead, so you'll never see him again. I'm so sorry, bye. All right, guys, they totally believed it. Sir Isaac Newston? Who do you think invented the news, Cody? I don't know. Sounds believable to me. Thanks, Joseph. So my parents really think I'm dead? Yep, they think you're dead, so you don't have to go home and show them your report card. Sweet. But wait, where is Jeffy going to live? Because he can't go home. Oh, you're right. Jeffy doesn't have a place to live. Hey, Cody, can he stay with you for a while? But me? I don't want him living with me. But it's your fault that we had to do that whole phone call thing. Well, how is this my fault? I told you it was a bad idea. Because you wouldn't let us borrow your report card. Well, I would have rather you taken my report card than have him live with me. Well, look, it's your fault, so now you have to let him live with you. But why can't he live with Joseph? Dude, I live in a cardboard box. <sighs> okay, fine. He can stay with me for one night. Come on, Jeffy. Ah! Oh, baby, what's wrong? What's wrong? What's wrong? Jeffy, no! What? What, say it without crying. Jeffy died. What? Well, why are you so calm? You told me to calm down. Well, but how did Jeffy die? What'd they say? It was a plane crash. Fire. A, a plane crash. Baby, a plane crash. Really? That sounds like a prank call. Let's call the real cops and see if it's true. Okay. Hey there. Somebody call the cops. Oh uh, yes, officer. We got a call from another officer saying our son died today. Oh well, who was the officer that called you? Officer tells bad news, Johnson. Really? Officer tells bad news Johnson? No, that's just ridiculous. Officer tells bad news Johnson retired 20 years ago. This is probably a prank call. A prank call? Baby, what else did the call say? Well, there was a plane crash, and the guy flying it was Sir Isaac Newston. Sir Isaac Newston? No, that name's just silly. Yeah, this is definitely a prank call. Well, why would somebody want to fake our son's death? Well, did your son...
son have something big coming up that maybe he was trying to get out of? Well, he was getting his report card today. Yeah, I bet that's it. I bet he got a bad grade and he faked his death to get out of it. Why would Jeffy do this? Because he didn't want to get grounded. Thank you for helping us, officer. Okay. Yeah, I just, um, guess I'll take off. Just, uh, just leave. Honestly, I really don't want to go. Well, you don't have to leave. Oh, okay, cool. Thanks. What about our son? He'll probably come home, baby. He has nowhere else to go. <gasps> yeah. Yeah, so, um, what do you guys want to do? I, I mean, there's nothing to do. Find our son. Hey, you want to play slap hands? What's that? Well, try to slap my hand. Ha <laughs> ha! Got you, loser! <laughs> well, you try to slap my hand. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Easy, loser! Oh, no, 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 let me try again. Okay. Nope. Nope. Marvin. Nope. Nope. Marvin. Nope. Marvin! What? Call me Jeffy! Well, I gotta try to slap his hand! Nope. 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 <laughs> Okay, that's it. You're under arrest. You're under arrest. Ow, 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 ow. Uncle, uncle, get off me. <sighs> okay, Jeffy, you can only stay here one night and then you have to go. Okay. Now, look, my parents are a little weird, so just ignore them. All right. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. Now, would you look what the cat drugged in? Hey, Dad. Ooh, Cody, who's your sexy friend? Meow. Hey, woman, keep your eyes on me. I'm the only one that can cheat in this house. Yes, Daddy. Well, uh, guys, this is my friend Jeffy. His parents kicked him out, and he needs a place to stay, so can he spend the night? If his parents don't want him, what make you think we do? Now, Tyrone, that's not how we treat our guests. So what's wrong with you? You some kind of junkie or something? You gonna hurt our little Cody? Yeah, what you got? What you holding, huh? Huh? No, no, no guys, he, he's not a junkie. He just needs a place to stay, so can he spend the night? I guess so, Cody, but I don't want to hear any of that loud rap music after midnight. Yeah, this is a jazz household. We don't like that rap music. <laughs> oh, and Cody, dinner's gonna be ready in a few minutes. We're having pierogies and party pizza. Ooh, pierogies? Oh, we feasting tonight, baby. So you and your friend go wash your hands and feet. Okay, Jeffy, welcome to my room. What, Ken, cover yourself up, you dirty, dirty boy. We have company. Sorry about that, Jeffy. Ken just doesn't know how to act around company. I think he needs a spanking. Hear that, Ken? I'm gonna spank your little plastic tush. Boy, you little weird old dinner's ready. God. Come on, Jeffy. Boy, will you hurry up? I'm hungry. I'm here, Dad. Wait, wait where's Jeffy's food? Oh, Cody, your friend's not eating at the table with us. Yeah, his plate over there in the corner on the floor. Wait, why? Well, we don't know where he's been. He might have rabies. Yeah, he like a stray dog. Well, I go to school with him. He doesn't have rabies. Cody, don't argue with me. I'll smack you. Uh, okay, uh, I'm sorry, Jeffy. You have to eat on the floor. Oh, okay. Oh. Oh. Hey, hey, hey! Don't touch that food we haven't said grace yet. All right, everybody bow your heads. Dear God, thank you for this delicious food. And thank you for not letting any of my side chicks get pregnant. Oh, thank God for that. Mm-hmm. Thank you for good health in a short refractory period. Amen. Amen. That's just a beautiful prayer, honey. That's how prayer should be, straight from the heart. Mm-hmm. I meant that. Okay, Cody, eat your food. Wait, Mom, what is this? It's a pierogi. Eat it. You're going to grow up big and strong. Yeah. Big boys got to eat their pierogies. Oh, I hate eating off the floor. So, boy, how was school today? Yeah, Cody, did you learn a lot of new stuff? Well, we got our report cards. Oh, my God, Tyrone, got all A's. Great googly moogly. You know what that means. Zerber time. Oh, um, I'm done. Hey, 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 shut the hell up. It's Zerber time, boy. It's Zerber time. Let's go to the bedroom. <laughs> okay, Cody, let me see that belly. But my looks so ticklish. <laughs> <laughs> nah, baby, give me some Zerbers. I need some. <laughs> I love Zerbers. Ooh, mom, one more, one more. Uh oh, give me some more, baby. Give me some. <laughs> <laughs> come on, mom, come on, do another one. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck is going on? Come on, baby. Yeah, I need some. Ooh, <laughs> so ticklish. Oh, I want to go back home. All right, Marvin, your turn. Hmm. Oh, you're so done. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, you did not just do that. You just lost. Check it out. Oh. Connect four, I win. Uh, I, did, I mean to put it right there. <laughs> you suck. I wish my wife sucked as much as you. She's really good at connect four. She beats me every time. We're playing again. Can we please go find Jeffy? Baby, look. Jeffy faked his death. He has nowhere else to go. Eventually, he has to come home. Oh, hey, you know what would be funny? Whenever your son comes home, you should pretend you can't see him like he's a ghost, you know, because he's dead. That'd be so funny. That's so mean. That's what we're going to do, baby. Whenever Jeffy gets here, we're going to not talk to him. We're going to act like he doesn't exist. Oh, let's answer the door and act like we can't see him. Okay. 
Uh, hello? Hey, Danny. I'm sorry I faked my own death. Baby, there's no one at the door. Do you see anybody? I sure don't, Marvin. Daddy, I'm right here! <sighs> Must have been a prank. Some kid rang the doorbell and ran away. I guess so. Why can't you see me? I'm right here! <sighs> I wish Jeffy didn't die. Me either, Marvin. I didn't die! I'm right here! Let's go upstairs, baby. Okay. Daddy, 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 daddy! Who was at the door? Is that your son? Yeah, play along. Okay. Danny, I'm right here! I miss Jeffy. I miss him too, baby. <laughs> I'm right here! Hey, I know you're going through a lot with your son dying and all, but I'm ready for the funeral. We're ready for the funeral too. Funeral? We don't need a funeral because I'm alive! I'm right here! Okay, here's his tombstone. Oh, oh the no. tombstone! Here's his body. Oh, not his body. Oh, no. Oh, That's no. not my body. I'm alive. I'm right here, oh, Daddy. I'm right here. I can feel his soul trying to contact me. Oh. Okay, you ready to start the ceremony? Yes. All right. We're gathered here today to be sad about the death of Jeffy, who was taken away from us too soon. We don't usually question God's plan, but today we ask... Why, God? Why did you take this young man away from us in such a tragic and comedic way? Why? I curse you, God! Amen. Would anyone else like to say a few words for Jeffy? I would. Jeffy, if you could hear me right now, we love you. We wish we could hear your voice one more time. I'm right here! Here's my voice! Ah! Settle down. Calm down. That, that's, that's enough of that. Uh, let, let, let's just have a moment of silence for Jeffy. I pooted. You folks have a nice day. I'm right here! I'm right here in front of you! Wait a minute. I, I think I hear Jeffy from the great beyond. What, you do? I think so. Jeffy, are you there? Yes, I'm right here! Right in front of your face! Oh, I, I, I can hear you, Jeffy, but I'm the only one. Is there anything you'd like for me to tell your parents? Yes! Tell my mommy and daddy that I'm sorry I faked my own death! Okay, he says that he's not sorry and he would do it all again. What? what no! We... I'm right here! Look, we can see you, okay? What? Jeffy? What? Daddy, you can see me? Oh, Jeffy, you're back! Oh, oh I'm so sorry, Daddy! daddy. I'm oh, so sorry! I'm so sorry I faked my own death! I just didn't want you to see my report card! What? Why wouldn't you want us to see your report card, Jeffy? Why don't you go get it? Oh, okay. All right, Daddy, here's my report card. All Fs, Jeffy! Well, I tried my hardest! No, you didn't! You did not try at all! These are all Fs! We're gonna need another funeral after I'm done with him. Well, funerals aren't cheap. Ah!